As you all know, this is a four thread overlocker. And what we're gonna be doing today is actually applying rubber um, in Lycra. So I've got a lightweight Lycra print and I've also got a medium weight Lycra um, as well. So first of all, you need to, I'll move the light so you can actually see. This is the six mil rubber to, to actually, you need to feed it through the rollers. So you thread it through the top, through the little roller, down in here, and there's an actual hole. Obviously the machine needs to be switched off. Raise your foot, tuck that rubber underneath, fold it back to where the foot is, and then you press that to lock that in. So to begin, you always need to let the um, switch the machine on, hold on to your rubber, and you just need to overlock. Just a little bit applying um, the rubber. The reason why, because the tension gauge. So when, um, if you stop and start, the tension will go flat and then it will go quite, it will gather also the fabric. So to begin, you need to place the right side of the fabric, lift your foot slightly just to help. And you're gonna place it on the seam edge. I'm not pulling it, I'm just gonna feed it. So all the tension is pretty much set by, um, by my technician, by the mechanic. There are different weights of Lycra. You might need to apply it on jersey. It depends on what you're making, but you always need to test it before you do your sample. So as you can see, there is the bottom of the, bottom of the, uh, the wrong side of the fabric, and this is your right side applying rubber on a light um, lycra print. And then this is the thick, quite of a medium weight lycra. Same, same um, ply it on the seam edge and you don't need to pull it. If you pull the fabric, it gathers quite a lot. So you're not, don't pull, just feed it through. Um, and each of us that get to the machine, we handle the machine completely different. So it doesn't mean it's wrong. Um, you just need to practice a few times, especially applying rubber to Lycra because it slips. Keep feeding that through. There's a little rubber cutoff here along in there. And that's the finish um, on the medium weight Lycra. So I always leave extra on the either end. The reason why when we're gonna hem this with the zigzag machine, I'll show you. We're going to fold that um, and hold on to the tail end of the rubber and cut that off at the end. So applying rubber, it's on the four thread overlocker. We have two of those in house, but that's exactly um, the technique of applying rubber and feeding it through on an overlocker. Make sure you switch your machine off, let it run for the next person to jump on the machine.